Now on Coast TV News. Del Marva rocket launch, the latest blast off from Wallops Island, and how it involves the University of Delaware. Biden to leave Rehoboth Beach. We have the next stop for the president and its purpose. This is Coast TV News Midday. Good morning and thank you for joining us. I'm Matt Pensick and welcome to Coast TV News Midday. Just a few hours remaining in spring. We've got a live look now. This is our check in at Dover. Lots of blue skies there. Another sunny day in our first alert meteorologist Bob Try. He joins us now with a look at first alert weather. Good morning, Bob. Good morning, Matt. We are bidding farewell to spring just a few hours away till the summer solstice and it's feeling like summer for sure. Lower to mid 80s right now. Inland areas of Delaware, Maryland, 84 in Redding, 81 in Georgetown. Cooler 70s from Rehoboth down to Ocean City, but Ocean Pines, 81 degrees. Dew point temperatures in the 60s and low 70s. That's telling us that air is getting muggy and uncomfortable and already feels like temperatures in some cases into the mid 80s around Seaford and Redden and elsewhere in the low to mid 80s and feeling like 70s along the coast. A bit of a sea breeze there, but inland really no relief from the warmth. As we're seeing cumulus clouds popping up over land right now, we have high pressure offshore of Bermuda High, so it's a southerly flow around that high that is bringing in the heat in. It's going to be toasty this afternoon, mid to upper 80s, cooler 70s at the beaches and 5 o'clock summer will be here and feeling like it with those temperatures well above normal inland areas and just a little cooler at the beaches. So very warm today into the upper 80s and then it's hot Friday and sizzling heat into the weekend. We'll talk about that and how long the heat wave sticks around coming up in a few minutes. All right, thanks, Bob. The big scene from earlier this morning. This was at the NASA facility on Wallops Island. A Terrier improved Orion sounding rocket blasting off right when the launch window opened at 5.30 a.m. It's carrying six scientific experiments, each in a canister about 10 inches in diameter and 10 inches tall. University of Delaware students actually have one of the experiments. That one involves measuring potential changes to electrons at a higher altitude. NASA, they do like the sounding rockets since they consider them cost effective. They are mostly used to carry instruments for measurements and experiments. They can reach 90 miles above the Earth's surface. Wallop's next sounding rocket launch is being targeted for August. Tonight, President Biden and First Lady Jill Biden will leave Rehoboth Beach after their brief stay on our coast. According to the White House press office, Biden will head to Dover Air Force Base around 8 p.m. for a flight on Air Force One. That's to Hagerstown, Maryland, and then arrive at Camp David just before 9.30. It is expected he will spend the weekend there to prepare for next week's presidential debate with Donald Trump. The temporary flight restriction for the Delmarva Coast expected to be lifted at 9 p.m. We are learning that there is a search for a suspect in Rehoboth Beach. It involves a sexual assault. According to the Rehoboth Beach Police Department, the assault occurred just after midnight Wednesday morning. It was on the beach in the area of Brooklyn Avenue, that is south of the bandstand. The victim was taken to an area hospital, treated there, and released. Developing news out of Bethany Beach, where the speed limit on State Route 26 has been officially reduced. This change follows an assessment by a traffic group and national traffic engineering firm, which recommended lowering the speed limit within the town. DelDot officials hope that this adjustment will make it safer for pedestrians, especially during the busy summer season. We went to Bethany Beach to better understand how people there feel about the change. And here is what one woman told us. We're a young family and we've been riding our bikes around a little bit more and so something like that would make me feel more comfortable, maybe more awareness for people that are out of town, not comfortable driving these, we're not familiar with these roads. And the speed limit change to Route 26, it is now in effect. For a full week now, a new four-way stop has been in effect at the Harbison Road, Shingle Point Road, Chestnut Street intersection in Milton and this was a move made by DelDot after the agency determined there was an issue with safety and visibility. Specifically, there were some blind spots on some of the turns, but one problem locals are seeing, some drivers they are just driving right through the intersection without stopping. We went to Milton to learn more, and here's what one person who lives there said. Uh, a lot of out-of-towners that come in, they don't realize that the speed limit is 35 or 25, and they're constantly doing 40, 50 miles an hour, which is really crazy. Got a lot of bikers, a lot of pedestrian walkers, so it's, it's good to slow them down. Del Dot says since 2020, last four years, there have been nine accidents at that one intersection. 
does bring us to our Coast TV poll. We want to know if you think are four-way stops effective for traffic safety. And so far, an overwhelming number of you are saying yes, they are, 78%, although that vote total, that percentage breakdown actually went down over the past couple of hours. 22% are chiming in in the no vote. We have developing news out of Delaware. It's where the effort to get the death penalty reinstated following the murder of Del Mar Police Corporal Keith e Cook appears to have failed. New legislation approved by the House of Representatives would permanently abolish the death penalty in the state. It requires that any adult convicted of first-degree murder to instead be sentenced to life in prison without the possibility of probation, parole, or any other sentence reduction. House Bill 70 now moves to the Senate for review. Coming up, Texas tropical storm. What is being tracked in the Gulf of Mexico and the response that is underway? Coast TV News Midday returns after this. Secondhand smoke lingers for hours. And it's killed almost 3 million people since 1964. When you smoke in the house, everyone in the house smokes. So take it outside. Visit takeitoutsidede.org. Save the date, Friday, June 21st. Watch the 68th annual DFRC Blue Gold All-Star Football Game on the Delmarva Sports Network and the DSN app. See Delaware's best high school athletes compete while supporting DFRC's mission to enrich lives of Delawareans with intellectual disabilities. The game kicks off at seven. The DFRC Blue Gold Game, live from the University of Delaware, Friday, June 21st, only on the Delmarva Sports Network and the DSN app. When it comes to protecting your home, don't take chances with just anyone. Trust the experts at Spicer Brothers. Join thousands of satisfied customers who've chosen us for our exceptional service, quality installation, and unbeatable warranties. Whether you need a roof replacement or just want to upgrade the look of your home, we've got you covered. And right now, save up to 20% on your new roof, plus enjoy no interest and no payments until 2026. For a roof that's done right, trust Spicer Brothers day and night. Because you deserve the best. Are you struggling to lose weight? Do you want to live a healthier and more empowered life? Whether it's been a lifelong struggle or you're new to weight loss, we can help you get the results you're looking for. At Tidal Health, we offer a comprehensive and customized approach to weight loss that includes surgical and medical options. Our team of dedicated professionals is committed to making sure you have the knowledge and support to reach your goals and get on the path to wellness. To learn how you can reach your goal weight, visit TidalHealth.org slash lose weight today. Well, we had old concrete, so we wanted to have a cohesive space that we could use outside and that we would be proud of. We truly enjoy it. It was kind of a no-brainer for us. It was beautiful. He showed us all the samples. We held them up to the light. It was wonderful. I mean, it was seamless. And everybody was so nice. Why we went with this instead of just painting it or whatever, it is the lifetime warranty. Anybody that asks or sees it, I always tell them it's Pinnacle, and I definitely would recommend them. Happening today, Fenwick Island will review the town's budget and two of the key items here, they're going to look at rentals and dredging. The town's budget and finance committee working on an updated draft for the fiscal year 2025. Specifically, they're looking to see how dredging could impact the budget as well as the rental tax rates. The committee will consider a fee schedule recommendation to town council. Also today, it's the last day if you're looking to vie for a seat on South Bethany's town council. Council has one vacant seat. It's open to them to finish the current term ending in May of 2025. Town is accepting letters of interest for the open position, but those letters need to be turned in soon by noon today, less than an hour. All requirements must be met, which includes being at least 21 years old. Interested candidates can contact the town office for more information. First name store of the hurricane season strengthened slightly late Wednesday as it moved towards Mexico's Gulf Coast. The weather system is impacting the state of Texas. It's bringing heavy rain flooding to the area. Tropical storm Alberto formed over the western Gulf of Mexico and it is large. It has tropical storm force winds extending out 460 miles. The Texas A&M Forest Service has mobilized four teams made up of 100 personnel and 24 vehicles. 
Here in Del Marva, we will not be feeling the effects of Alberta, but what a day to be on the water. Dry tech cam, jet skier there, maybe another one there, some boats. It is that time of year as summer is just around the corner. And it is a warm first day of summer and the heat building, especially Friday and into the upcoming weekend as well. You'll need that sunscreen as temperatures near Ocean City top 80 degrees today. We're looking at a nine, very high on the UV index. Burn time only 10 minutes in that very high range right through the weekend into early next week. So follow the these precautions to stay safe, stay safe in the sun. I'll have much more on the heat wave headed our way after the break. Everyone knows us for termites and bed bugs, but don't forget we're also here for all your general pest control needs. Ants, spiders, crickets, rodents, fleas, ticks, and of course, mosquitoes. Bennett Termite is dedicated to protecting our communities from your aggravations and dangers presented by pests of all kinds. If you want to find out the Bennett difference, give us a call today. Remember Delmarva, quality isn't expensive, it's priceless. I potentially be dead is the reality of it. I mean, fentanyl kills a lot of people. I heard about addiction medical facility from another company and I came in here, you know, no judgment, no stigma. It was, you need help, let's help you. What do you need? They have intensive outpatient. It's a little more intense. You can see your counselor a little more. They've shown nothing but love. Now here I am. I started a grooming business. If I didn't start recovery, it, it could have looked very different for me. And you just have to remember there's always hope. And I feel like addiction medical facility is the place for that. No one ever thinks they need an injury lawyer until they do. And for most people, that's the worst day of their lives. I have dedicated the last 24 years of my career to helping people put their lives back together. Sometimes this is making sure medical bills and lost wages are paid. In other cases, this may mean millions of dollars in compensation. Whether your case is big or small, you need an advocate protecting your rights. Our firm can help. Call Bearman Dallas Brockstead Federico. Right lawyers, right now. Have you visited Tyndall's Casual Furniture this season? Come see us! Why shop online when you can explore Delmarva's exclusive Hollywood dealer in person? See the finishes, feel the fabrics, and even sit on the furniture. From polymer to aluminum, wicker and ePay, bring home the perfect blend of quality and design with Tyndall's. Crafted to enhance your lifestyle, all of our furniture comes with professional assembly and take advantage of our in-house white glove delivery. Tyndall's Casual Furniture, Delmarva's outdoor furniture experts. The big issues, abortion, civil rights, health care. When Trump policies were attacking our rights, County Executive Matt Meyer fought back. Now Trump is promising a national abortion ban and huge cuts to health care coverage. Matt's health care plan will reduce costs, not coverage, by increasing competition on the exchange. And Matt's plan will protect women's access to abortion, always. So call Matt Meyer. Tell him you support his plans to protect Delaware values. We have just a few more hours remaining of springtime and boy, spring is going out on a gorgeous note, feeling like summer and well, summer's starting here soon. So uh, no shock, Tyndall's casual furniture camera showing some high clouds, some cumulus clouds, a gorgeous day in Laurel, 82, dew point 65. That humidity is starting to creep up and your temperatures by mid afternoon into the upper 80s and the countdown continues to summer. The summer solstice occurs this afternoon at 4.50 p.m. It is it is the longest day of the year. In fact, we've got 14 hours, 52 minutes and 42 seconds of daylight getting light now around 5 a.m. and not getting really totally dark till about nine. And the days do start to get shorter after this. And usually as the days get shorter, it cools off. But there's a couple of month delay there. In fact, we're looking at a big warm up into the weekend. 88 today to 92 on Friday. That marks the beginning of our heat wave. The first full day of summer, 95 on Saturday. Sunday is the most miserable miserable day heat wise 96 and then 92 on your money. In fact, we have an excessive heat watch for Sunday for Sussex County. In fact, all of Delaware and adjacent areas of the Eastern Shore. We could be talking about heat index values 100 to 105. So that's going to be a tough day. Make sure you check on the elderly that day and make sure they have a cool place. It's warming up now. Low 80s inland, some middle 80s from Seaford up to Milford, while it's 74 in Rehoboth, 75 Bethany Beach, Ocean City right now at 70. 
76. Dew point temperatures in the 60s to around 70. Starting to get pretty muggy out there. And those feels like temperatures already upper 80s. Seaford and Redden and uh, a little better along the coast. But it's going to get increasingly muggier with this southerly wind. Visible satellite picture showing what looks like cotton balls. These are those fair weather cumulus clouds across Del Marva right now. We zoom out the picture. We've got high pressure way offshore right over Bermuda. We call this a Bermuda high. The flow coming around that out of the south and it's a big heat dome back to our south and west that will be building in for the weekend. So this afternoon a warm one mid to upper 80s and then cooler at the beaches and then this evening as we are firmly entrenched in summer looking at temperatures falling from the 80s into the 70s. We're into the mid 60s Friday morning. So the last pleasant morning temperature wise and then those temperatures skyrocket on your Friday afternoon into the lower 90s inland areas 70s and 80s along the coast and it will be a pretty mild night. In fact, warm night into Saturday morning temperatures only dipping into the low to mid 70s and then by the afternoon low to mid 90s. Very hot conditions there and that trend will continue into your Sunday as well. Future feels like temperatures lower 90s today, low to mid 90s on Friday. Then it gets bad into the weekend, upper 90s and triple digit feels like temperatures on Saturday, even 90s along the coast and Sunday's the worst 100 to 105 bordering on dangerous feels like temperatures at that time and not as bad on Monday as we're looking at muggy conditions, which gradually turn to humid conditions and very humid conditions. Maybe some of that dangerous heat by Sunday, but then we start to dry it out and cool it off a little bit to the early part of next week. 88 this afternoon, warm and muggy 65 tonight, partly cloudy and pleasant. Then 92 first full day of summer on your Friday. Paul Davis seven day forecast mid 90s Saturday and Sunday. Those heat indices at least 100 degrees and then 92. Let's hope we get some rain and storms on Monday. We'll need it. A brief cool down to 89 Tuesday and then back to 93 on Wednesday. Partly cloudy. All right. All right. Thanks, Bob. Coming up, dialing back vacation dollars. We look at the trend this summer when it comes to taking time off in the U.S. Coast TV News Midday back in a moment. Here's what's coming up today at 4 on Coast Life. It's the first day of summer, so you're probably in need of some summer beach reads. Good thing we know the perfect place to get them. And every Thursday we spill the tea. Today we have some family drama that's piping hot. All that and more today at 4 on Coast Life. The beach, the yard work, road trips. You need a vacation from summer vacation. And all you really want is a good night's sleep in your own bed. But is it comfortable? Find your dream mattress at Out and Brothers Home Furnishings. Memory foam, inner spring, pool top, pillow top, adjustable base. The perfect mattress to fit every body and every budget, with payments as low as $19 a month. That's less than taking the family out for ice cream. And <laughs> mama needs a new mattress. From Outen Brothers, furnishing Del Marva for over 75 years. Is a kitchen remodel on your to-do list? Paul Davis offers an easy three-step kitchen refacing solution. Step one, we bring the showroom to you. Step two, we give you the exact price that day. Step three, our certified installers complete it in days, not weeks. A revitalized kitchen without the disruption. At half the cost of a traditional kitchen remodel. In the style and color you've always wanted. Last chance to get 20% off your new kitchen, plus a free trash can pullout or no payments until 2025. Call Paul Davis today or visit our showroom. For me, working for a company that is so involved in the community means consistency, integrity, and it means success. My favorite part of working at Avery Hall is we're like a family. And when the client walked out and said, you're a breath of fresh air, I love your aura, that made me feel like I educated the client and I gave them the information needed to make a logical decision. I'm Tracy Jones, Account Executive with Avery Hall Insurance. Treat yourself to a culinary journey like no other at Benvenuto. Delaware Today named Benvenuto as a 2023 Best of Delaware Dining and Event Restaurant, where the perfect fusion of comfort, exquisite flavors, and a captivating atmosphere awaits you. Our passion for exceptional cuisine shines through every dish as we artfully combine international flavors and fresh, locally sourced ingredients. With stunning spaces and a private room for special occasions, our breathtaking Tuscan design sets the stage for an unforgettable dining experience. Benvenuto Restaurant in Milford. Beneath your feet lies a hidden terror. Moisture and humidity turning your crawl space into a breeding ground for mold and rot. 
But fear not, DryTech is here to help. Just call our office and request a prompt appointment. Our engineers are not salespeople. They assess your crawl space, photograph it, prescribe a custom solution, and send you your personalized estimate the next business day. Guaranteed. And right now, take advantage of 0% financing for up to 24 months. DryTech, Delmar was original crawl space experts. On the first day of summer, consumers say they are planning to spend less on away-from-home entertainment and vacations this year. It's according to the 2024 KPMG Consumer Pulse Survey. It's a contrast to last summer when Americans shelled out big bucks on the Barbenheimer movie phenomenon, Taylor Swift and Beyonce concert tickets and giveaways. The survey found an average Americans expect to reduce their monthly spending by 7% on travel and vacations. Fast food customers who have been complaining about price hikes may soon find some relief. McDonald's is less than a week away from offering its customers a $5 value meal. The $5 meal deal was created in the hopes of lowering back customers and boosting sales. More Coast TV News Midday after this. The UV Index Weather Report is sponsored by Ocean City Tourism. Somewhere to smile about. The Olympic Games are coming. But first... The best American athletes have to make Team USA. The U.S. Olympic Team Trials on NBC and Peacock. It's moments like these that remind me of the oath that I took to protect the innocent. This job had a plan for me. Law & Order SBU for your Emmy consideration. When you visit the Delmarva Design Center, you'll experience a selection of appliances, cabinetry, countertops, tile, and flooring all together in one showroom. The 10,000 square foot location has a variety of inspiring samples for any project size or budget. Your dedicated product experts and designers collaborate to bring your dream project to life. Come and see what the kitchen industry buzz is all about. Experience the Delmarva Design Center in Selbyville, Delaware, serving all of Delmarva's coast. Born in the stars, formed in the earth, shaped by designers around the world, and curated by Kalsa Jewelers in Lewis. Paul Chen, also known as Sunder Kalsa, is a meditation and yoga master as well as the owner of Kalsa Jewelers. At Kalsa Jewelers, we offer signature pieces to celebrate love and those special moments in our life. Peace to all, light to all, love to all. Celebrate with us at Historic Lewis and Rehobo Beach. The doctors of Delmarva Chiropractic take great pride in offering the finest, most individualized care to their patients and stay on the cutting edge of healthcare and clinical interventions. As winners of Coastal Style and Metropolitan Magazine's Best Chiropractors for seven years in a row, doctors Lane, Brown, and Taylor help with conditions such as back pain, sciatica, headaches, concussions, dizziness, and much more. The clinic also offers laser therapy, decompression, acupuncture, and custom orthotics. Call Delmarva Chiropractic today and take the first step toward achieving your maximum potential. Turn on Bionic Spotlight Extreme 360, the motion-activated home defense light that looks just like a security camera. It detects even the slightest motion and automatically triggers six ultra-bright LED high beams. Call or go online and order your Bionic Extreme 360 for just $19.99. Plus, get free shipping on your entire order. To order, call 1-800-316-1548 or go online to buybionic360.com. Call now. Surgeon General wants a warning label on social media apps, but these plans take time, and Karen Kafish shows us how families can strike a safe balance on screen time. School is out, and Dr. Michael Rich, founder of the Digital Wellness Lab at Boston Children's Hospital, wants to bring back boredom. So we fill it with what ifs and dreams, and let's do this, as opposed to defaulting to a screen and basically giving over our attention and our mind to someone else. There's been a lot of conversation this week about children and screen time. Yes. On Tuesday, the board of the Los Angeles Unified School District voted in favor of a ban on cell phones during the school day, effective January 2025. And in a New York Times op-ed Monday, U.S. Surgeon General Vivek Murthy proposed social media apps have warning labels like alcohol and cigarettes. If we can come together, have each other's backs, and make a pact, to put in place these rules for our families, it's easier for us, it's also easier for our kids. 
Stephen Balcom, founder and CEO of the Family Online Safety Institute, says he'd like Congress to act on online privacy and safety and for tech companies to be more responsible. But for now, households should make rules. And realize and, and factor in downtime and you know screen-free zones in the house like the bedroom or the dining room table, screen-free time zones like dinner, like mealtime. Balcom and Dr. Michael Rich say parents can lead by example and put down their devices too. Let's remember how precious this time is with these kids. They're not going to be this age forever. Let's enjoy them. In Washington, I'm Karen Kafa. We're seeing lots of sunshine in Seaford right now. 82 for you and muggy and headed for the upper 80s today as summer is just officially a few hours away. Warm today, then hot Friday, and even hotter into the upcoming weekend. Remember to call the first alert weather phone, 443-880-9100. Your forecast is to call away. Sponsored by Bear, Medallas, Brockstead, and Federico. I'll have your toasty 10-day forecast coming up next. Save the date, Friday, June 21st. Watch the 68th Annual DFRC Blue Gold All-Star Football Game on the Delmarva Sports Network and the DSN app. See Delaware's best high school athletes compete while supporting DFRC's mission to enrich lives of Delawareans with intellectual disabilities. The game kicks off at 7. The DFRC Blue Gold Game, live from the University of Delaware, Friday, June 21st, only on the Delmarva Sports Network and the DSN app. Life isn't always easy. Sometimes we need a little bit of help to work through life's more challenging problems. At Addiction Medical Facility, we are here for you, believing in your strengths to overcome any obstacle. Whether it's addiction to substance use disorders or mental health issues, there's hope for a better tomorrow. Together, we can tackle what is holding you back. Our medication-assisted treatment combines FDA-approved medication with counseling, offering a holistic approach tailored to your needs. Addiction Medical Facility, together we find hope and healing. This is like our forever home. This was the last piece of the puzzle. Pinnacle concrete coating actually showed me this particular floor here, which is tidal wave. I was told, I'm done, I'm, I'm good, just let's start. When it was done, I probably sat out there for 20 minutes and just staring at the product before I went back into the house. This is not a garage, this is an extension of my home. I'm just thrilled to death with this floor. We get a discount for being a veteran. It made you real warm and fuzzy knowing that you're dealing with somebody like that. You know, I'm just impressed with what they did, it was awesome. Have you ever felt leg pain, restlessness, cramps, tingling, swelling, numbness, itchiness, or coldness? Then you need the new clinically proven Legsercise Pro, the natural circulation booster that uses continuous automatic leg movement to soothe pain and promote healthy circulation the natural drug-free way. After using Legsercise for a week, I felt like I wanted to go for a walk again without pain like I used to. Legsercise Pro's patented walking simulator propulsion technology moves your feet back and forth along its concave track, creating constant movement and flex at both the knee and ankle joints. It's like having a physical therapist right in your own home. It's helped with the swelling and the pain. The tingling feeling is gone. Call right now and order your very own Legsercise Pro, the clinically proven automatic leg mover that soothes pain and naturally promotes healthy circulation. Call now. Coming up on Coast TV News at 5, J1 Student Safety, we will look at the measures being taken in places like Bethany Beach to help these summer employees get familiar with working and living in a different country. That story and more on Coast TV News at 5. And summertime just about five hours away. It arrives officially this afternoon at 4.50. That is the start of summer, the summer solstice. Here's our day part forecast looking at temperatures in the mid to upper 80s as we go into the afternoon. Around 88 inland areas, 70s at the beaches, and then a slow decline in those temperatures as we go into the evening hours. Paul Davis 10 day forecast. Here comes the heat on Friday, looking at 92 lots of sunshine. And then for the weekend, buckle up. This is the meat of the heat wave middle 90s both Saturday and Sunday but with the humidity feeling like 100 to 105 degrees yeah it's going to be really hot check on your neighbors make sure everybody's cool this weekend especially on Sunday by Monday it cools off a little bit down to 92 maybe a few storms 89 on Tuesday then it's back to 93 Wednesday maybe another chance of storms as we head into Thursday with a high around 90 then upper 80s Friday into Saturday needless to say the summer heat is here looking at above normal 
normal temperatures. Stay safe in the sun and hope that we get more than two days of rain the next 10 days. All right. Thanks, Bob, and thank you for being with us on Coast TV News Midday. For more news and local weather, download our Coast TV News app. Don't forget to join us later for Coast TV News at 5. Till then, have a great Thursday, everybody.